There's three minutes left. And this had Anthony Joshua was right at the end. But there's three minutes left. Five seconds left. And Anthony Joshua was right. But there's three minutes left. And this had Anthony Joshua was right at the end. But there's three minutes left. Five seconds left. And Anthony Joshua was right. Yo, what's good family so mash the like button subscribe and lick off the bell so as you might have seen by the title and likely as you've heard over the last well 10 days now eight nine days now there's been some alleged controversy around the final round now i leaked the video that one of my sky insiders gave to me yesterday and i exposed team aj waving the white flag Essentially, or potentially rather, trying to bail AJ out. But moving on, this one's much more popular, or much more of a, a widely understood conspiracy. Is the fact that, allegedly again, the last round was stopped some five seconds before the end. Now, when you listen to the Sky, as we all know now, everyone in the UK can watch the Sky repeat back. The interviewer, or sorry, the, the commentator says, five seconds to go, and about a second later, the bell starts ringing. So it does look a bit fishy-lishy. However, this for me, we all know the YB. The YB is what we call scientific. He has a PhD in IQ, no doubt. Yeah? The YB has an honorary PhD from multiple top universities, Oxford, MIT, all them ones there. Honorary. No doubt. When you get to the 200 IQ club, they hand them out. Like, like, trust me, they hand them out like sweeties. Yeah? Every time I go to a different state, I get another PhD. But anyway, let's, let's crack on with the point here. The point is, people, I'm going to bring you the definitive proof about this conspiracy. Oh, it stopped five seconds early. It's really not hard to test. So what we're going to do is... At the start of this video, or throughout this video, you're going to see two clips. The first clip... You'll hear the bell ringing for the 12th round. Because we can test this. It's easy to prove how long the last round was. How can we prove it? All we've got to do is time. Count the amount of time between the first bell and the last bell. That's definitive. If the first bell is when the first bell is. And the last bell is at 2 minutes 55. We know it got stopped early. It's a fact, isn't it? And you can actually test it yourself at home. So what we can do is, we're going to bring up the Sky Sports link, and we're going to check the time, look at the timestamp for the first bell. So round 12 starts at literally 59.59 on the Sky link. 59.59 is when the 12th round starts. So if it was a true 3 minute round, we'd expect the end final bell to ring at 102.59. Why? Because that's obviously three minutes later. And two twos, unfortunately, for all of you conspiracy dons, and unfortunately for me, <laughs> this is one of the few ones I wasn't on a bandwagon with. Why? Because un rather than just shilling, that's on other channels, in fact, most channels I've heard shilling, are, oh, yeah, AJ got bailed out. You know me. I'm going to ride AJ as much as the next man. On, based on facts. What we're not going to do is propagate BS because we're lazy or because we're low IQ. Especially when sometimes it's hard to prove things, but this really is not hard to prove. This is real basic research you've got to do. So like I said, unfortunately, all you, all these dopey channels, oh yeah, all these, all these AJ hating channels, oh yeah, he got bailed out, oh yeah, this at the other. Not being funny people, yeah? If Sky... Or Eddie Hearn. We're really going to bail AJ out. Do you not think they would have just bought the judge? That's what I was expecting. I thought there's no way AJ going to lose on the cards. And this for me actually proved that Eddie Hearn doesn't buy judges. Proof. So when that Campbell Hatton thing happened. I know now it's all just random. Or maybe Ricky Hatton bought it. I don't know but it's not Eddie Hearn. 
Because if, if Eddie Hearn was buying anything, trust me, he'd have bought, <laughs> he'd have bought the Usyk. Because it weren't, yes, it would have been a robbery, but it wouldn't have been the worst robbery ever, I don't think, would it? There was no knockdowns. AJ's the home fighter. AJ's the champion. It wouldn't have been a massive stretch when you think of, historically speaking. I mean, for example, look at Floyd Mayweather. When Floyd Mayweather fought Alvarez, he lost, one of the judges gave it to Alvarez. So, it really wouldn't be a stretch for AJ to have won that fight. Bottom line. And guess what? Eddie Hearn, he didn't buy the judge. Now, of course, that's circumstantial. But, nonetheless, the proof is the proof. The proof is, the bell rang at 59.59, and three minutes later, it rang again. Three minutes. And I'm surprised, I'm not surprised. I was about to say, I'm surprised that all these goofy channels who were shilling, oh, AJ got saved, and I want a refund on this, that, the other. I want, I want, my, I want my coins back for William Hill, and... You, you man could all test it. It's got nothing to do with the clock. Oh, the zone clock says this. What's the zone clock got to do with the fact that you can time it? Time the round. Time when the round starts. Time when the round finishes. Do it yourself. Simple as that. Because the zone clock, yeah, it's it's the, the, the unfortunately the the zone clock isn't. It's not built into the the boxing fight. If that makes sense. You got that's that's why all the different broadcasters are different. The sky clock's different to the zone clock. Why? Because they're all just for our purpose. They're for the consumer, rather. If that makes sense. These clocks, the zone and sky, they're not plugged in to the original. If that makes sense. They're not plugged in to the one on ringside. These are just for the viewer's purpose. So they're proximate. Yeah. The broadcaster at Sky, or the, the, the team behind the broadcast at Sky, and the team behind the broadcast at Zone, they'll basically push the clock when the bell goes. It's one of them ones. Obviously, the man at the Zone that day was sleeping or slacking or whatever. Because, unless you man, and this is the thing, I'm all for hearing more evidence. For example, people could say things like, well, YB, maybe they edited the, the stream and now it's longer. I don't know. But no one ain't saying that. You man are saying that oh, it's blatantly just 2 minutes 55. That's not the case. And what you'll find is not one person has actually done the research and showed you how it, how it has actually proven it. Because unfortunately with time, time is what it is. 2 minutes 55 is 2 minutes 55. So you should be able to show me, look YB, the first bell went at 2.55, or the first bell went and 2 minutes 55 later, the second bell went. There ain't no evidence of that. I haven't seen it anyway. A lot of these lazy channels, they hear something, and it's not their fault. They hear something, their IQ doesn't enable them to think just a little bit deeper. Wait a minute, how about I try and test this myself? Nah, 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 we'll run with it. And it's funny, people call me RYB, you're number one conspiracy. What? No, we're number one proof. Yeah, we're number one sources. Yeah, we're number one manager. Yeah, we're number two trainer. Of all the things we are, I'll tell you what we ain't. Number one, low IQ, just shillings things for the sake of it. Just, just to jump on AJ, just to jump on AJ hate bandwagon. Oh, I, I'm the first one to say. Listen, his corner, they was waving the white flag, doing some fruity tooty thing for sure. There's no doubt about that. How can I say that? Why do I say that? Because there's proof of it. We see my man in the corner going ham with the, with the towel. <laughs> no doubt. I'd be a lie if I told you differently. But like I said, what we're not going to do is ride bandwagons that don't need to be ridden or that there's no proof yeah AJ he down bad enough right now yeah sorry Anthony Gandhi Mandela he down bad right now he don't need no more yeah <laughs> he don't need to the last thing AJ needs right now sorry the last thing Anthony Mandela Gandhi needs right now is more people thinking that he got bailed out because he already down bad he already was on the ropes, rocking and rolling for his life. The last thing, <laughs> the last thing he needs for his reputation is for people to believe that he got saved by Sky. At least give him that credit. At least give him the credit that he did see it through to the three minutes, which is, by the way, the facts. Yeah, I'm the you might know me. You've heard my videos. I'm the first one to ride AJ. He never should have been on the ropes. Yeah, this controversy never should have existed. If anything, we should have been debating 
whether Usyk got saved by the bell. That's what I'll be saying. That said, just because on this fight eight days ago, AJ AJ's performance was pathetic, it doesn't mean we can jump on bow wagons that have no they have no relevance. Now I understand where the initial kind of allegation came from, but there's some people. It's been proven now. It's been debunked. But again, if any of you man have any follow up information, oh I be but this that the other, come with it. I'm I'm open to seeing it. Maybe someone's going to say, "Why be?" But look, if you look at look at this timestamp, it just this it cuts out because potentially what they could do is they could ins no, no, in fact they can't do that. No, I was about to say they'd have to. How would they make it longer? They'd have to insert. They would have had to have inserted five seconds of dead time. That's what we'd have to see in this stream. For Sky to have kind of patched it between fight night. And this broadcast going out. Because I didn't I did realise that it was pretty slow. The fight happened. And then it took a few days. But then again. Sky always takes a few days. So really that's not a shock. But either way. What they'd have to do. They'd have to patch five seconds worth of. Dead. Dead time in there. And I've watched around. The there ain't five seconds of nothing in there. So. But then again, maybe they slowed it down. Maybe that last round they slowed it. Because AJ was looking super slow. <laughs> he was super slow. So maybe they slowed it. Because they had five seconds, what? Three minutes, yeah, is 180 seconds. So to slow it down five seconds, that's what? No, I can't do numbers, man. GG. <laughs> let's, let's call it 200. So no, 180 seconds, yeah? To slow it down five seconds, that would be approximately... You'd only have to slow it down about two and a half percent. That's not a lot. But anyway, I'm getting into the deep conspiracy thing right now. End of the day, people, there was no time. AJ wasn't saved. He was just on the ropes getting smoked for a full three minutes. And let's not take away from Usyk here. Because by saying it was only two minutes and 55, that takes away from the extra five seconds Usyk was smoking AJ's boots. Because you best believe for the whole three, round, three minutes, AJ's boots were smoked. Yeah, let's not take away from Usyk here. Let's not rob Usyk of them extra five seconds of smokage he was giving Anthony Mandela Gandhi. No doubt.